everybody. We are in Cordoba. I'm Amy from Temple Seeker and today I'm going to be taking you on a tour of an old Moorish city that dates back to the time of the Caliphate around 957 AD. So I think this is the shuttle bus. Yeah. Just arrived at the top uh, with a green bus transfer, so a couple of tips for you. They will ask you to wear your backpack on the front, particularly in the museum. Um, it's just for security and things. And then um, also there are toilets at the museum and when you arrive at the site of Al Hazara. So we're going to start exploring there. So here you can see the horseshoe arches of the basilica and they think that this was probably used for the caliphal administration. Make sure you wear comfortable shoes because as you can see the ground is not always the flattest or easiest to navigate. So this here would have been stables for about 25 to 30 horses and this marble um, trough was recovered during the excavation and put in the place where it, they think it was originally. So we're walking now down this ramped street which links the upper terrace and the great portico which are those big arches there. And this would probably have been um, used in political events and it's likely that it had some kind of vaulted roof over the top of it. It's, uh, it's wide enough for horses to come down as well. So this would have probably had an upper terrace section and this is called the Great Portico. It's basically where they would have the military processions in front of it and it would be um, where they would receive important people. So if you'd like to find out more about Medinat al-Zahra pop over to my website, it's www.templeseeker.com and you can find out more about this abandoned Moorish city. If you've got any questions, you can comment below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Speak to you soon. Bye.